10. He's back to pass. Taking a shot on the post. Wide open. Cut. Shown. Touchdown. That's how you say hello. Down to 10. Second series of the ball game for West Virginia. It's not Austin Kendall. It's Daigie in a quarterback who hands it off to Kennedy McCoy. Gets the first down, which has been an anomaly this year. Dusty per carry. There's a look at the paltry numbers on the ground this year. Daigie completes it. Middle of the field, all the way down to the 21-yard line to George Campbell. And they move the sticks again. Third and seven. Digging into the end zone, has a man, touchdown, George Campbell with the grab. That's a big time throw. Wow, Seth Dagey on third and seven, a dime. Football, I love that aspect. Thompson downfield, what a catch. Weber. Got him behind the DB on the play and one-handed it, tight roping down the sidelines. 25. Thompson out in space now. And out of bounds at about the 32-yard line. Kids, nothing yep. better than that. Thompson drops back. Whips it down the sideline, complete to Brooks. Brooks inside the 10. It's going to be first and goal. Blake Lynch going to try this one from 22 yards out. He knocks it through. And the Wildcats take a three-point lead, 10-3, with 4.43 to go in the first quarter. Second down and eight. It's going to be McCoy again. McCoy with a great burst over the left side. First down at midfield. Second down and one. Boy again. Pushed out of bounds close to the 30-yard line. Out of the backfield open to McCoy. He's got some room. And a good open field tackle by Patterson on the play. Hagey comes out to his right into the end zone. Caught. Touchdown, Mountaineers, Campbell. His second one of the game. Thompson has a little bit more time, taking a shot. Intercepted, wow, what a grab by Josh Norwood. Houdini in the house. I hope he's okay. This incredibly athletic grab. Here in his first season at Kansas State. He really bounced back after those two losses to Baylor and Oklahoma State. Joshua Youngblood with a nice run and a first down as we go back to the studio. Freshman and that's secondary for West Virginia. Third and three for Thompson. Almost sacked but got away. Enough to make the play in the first down. Weber with the catch and the run. Catch a pass to the tight end. It was well covered. Nowhere for Thompson to go with the ball. 33-yarder by Blake Lynch. Just got it inside that right upright. He's made his last 13 field goals in a row. Down with a nice game. First down still on his feet. Keeping it moving all the way out to the 47-yard line. And they've got a timeout remaining. 19 yards on the carry. Got a trip right for a motion. Deggy. Complete to the sideline and near the first down, Esdale making the catch. They spot it a yard shy of the first down. Field goal range Casey Leg has. This is going to be Lady Brown again. Still on his feet. A first down and then some inside the 30 and inside field goal range for Casey Leg. <laughs> Daigie open at the 25. Another catch and run by Eshdale, they are getting huge chunks of real estate at a time. That time they got nine. The season long is only 30. It's 
Snap is good, and he shanks it to the left. And sometimes you got to finish your breakfast. They moved it all the way down to the field and come up empty. That's funny. I was just thinking that uh, this had the feel of a trap game for the Wildcats. Pass complete. Good catch by Gilbert. Oh, but couldn't make the defender miss. Tyke Smith got him by the shoestrings and Weber in motion. Thompson downfield is receiver nicely comes back to make the catch on the play. That's Malik Knowles, who has been conspicuous by his silence so far. He's one of their big time receivers. Picks up 13 on the play. Judicious with him in practice and how much his usage is. First and ten, the pass complete. Good catch and run for another first down. That's James Gilbert, a very agile receiver as well. Chandler making the tackle on the play, but a gain of 12. Just outside the 20. Thompson gets rid of it quickly. Complete. Caught and inside the five-yard line. Shown with a clutch catch for 17 yards. First and goal, Kansas State. Second and goal. Little option. Thompson on the pitch to Gilbert. He walks in for a touchdown. That's really Kansas State football. Long, methodical drive. One of the real catalysts on that Eagle squad. And that pass complete underneath to Jennings, the true freshman. The Mountaineers have a lot of true freshmen that make key contributions. Go to ESPN Plus. Dot com. Second and 13. Daigie over the middle in traffic and a catch. What a grab by George Campbell, who is having a career here today. This is a big time throw. Casey Leg. More than enough leg. Got it. And the lead is down to three. And he had some room to spare. Once again for West Virginia. Dagey. Just got rid of it in time. Wide open. Room service. Touchdown. Wheaton. They turned him loose. Go get it. Dagey got rid of it just in time. And Bryce Wheaton... Well, nobody was within the same area code as him. See a mix of both quarterbacks at times, but not so. On second and ten, Skyler Thompson taking off and sliding in, and he took a hit, a flag thrown, and Thompson shaken up on the play by Lowe. Played in four games, hands it off to Jordan Brown. Brown's going to pick up another first down at the 34-yard line. Kept those legs churning. Oh, you don't but, like it? Why? They're rolling the dice. Fourth and 12. Thompson under heat. Still is chasing him. Incomplete. No flag. And the Mountaineers take over on downs. Intended for Josh Youngblood. And broken up on the play. Complete. Let's see where they spot it. Thompson complete at the 40 and up for the first down. Good catch by Brooks. Went right back to him. Shown at the top of your screen right there. They look in that direction. Goes to the back wide open. Brown picks up the first down. Game-winning drive for Skylar Thompson. And what in motion. Over the middle complete to Brooks on the move. And tackled shy of the 30. They move the chains again on the 15-yard game. Thompson, middle of the field. Caught. Hakeem Bailey picked it off. Hakeem Bailey picked it off. 
outstanding job in coverage by Akeem Bailey. It's a double move. Early season film to make sure we've progressed. You can tell this has been a tough season, guys. But it ends on a positive note here tonight, Olivia. And here's one thing to think about, too, with Jared Dagey. He's going to start the last two games, and he will redshirt this year because he only will have played in four games, yeah. and then he's going to have two more years in the future to be a quarterback at West Virginia. That's the man of the night, Jared Dagey. What a performance.